Okay, just to clarify, do you like having relations with people of the same sex as you? Scandalous! <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Heart is the heart hearting. It's the heart hearting. Okay, we have the fireplace again. Um, and before anyone was like, Anya, why would you do this? Somebody asked me to do this. I swear, I swear I did not come up with this on my own. But today we'll be taking a slew of BuzzFeed gay quizzes because why not? I'm feeling festive. Mm, you know? So yeah, I think that's really about it. I'm about to be God, I don't know what's gonna go down. I really, oh my God, I'm always doing the dumbest, like, oh my, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Someone call my therapist after this. All right, let's get into it. First quiz we have, right? How gay are you? How gay am I? We're about to see. I picked out three quizzes, right? So really, cause I feel like these quizzes are short. So, you know, I, I want us to get like a full fledged experience, a full fledged queer experience. So that's what we're doing. You've come here with the question and we have the def the definitive, I swear I can read y'all, I swear I can, I swear. Answer, you'll find out exactly how gay you are once and for all. Enjoy and answer honestly, please. It's important for the science. Completely honest, Scouts Honor. Yeah. All right, choose your favorite color. Red, blue, pink, lilac, green. Now the girls that know know my favorite color is purple, but twist, twist, because y'all think y'all know everything. It's actually blue, purple, and green. You see what I'm saying? You know, twisty, twisty, you know what I'm saying? Um, which one do I like the most though? Mm. We'll just go with purple. It's been like my favorite color for the longest. Pick your favorite Beyonce song. All the single ladies, all the single ladies. Single, single lady, single, single lady. Wow, wow, that, that song is really, speaks to me right now. That really sums up the era of my life right now. Flawless, run the world, drunk in love, crazy in love. To be honest, I'm not into Beyonce. Are the girls gonna hate me if I say, I, oh, the broken nail. Are the girls gonna hate me if I say I don't like Beyonce like that for real? <laughs> don't jump me, don't jump me, don't jump me. I'm just saying personally for me. Somebody is so angry. I don't really like Beyonce like that. It's probably because my mom like overplayed her growing up, but like, girl, I'm not into it. Do you enjoy consensual sexual experience or feel a sexual attraction to members of the same sex as yourself? What? Whoa, that was a lot of words. Hold on, back up. Do you enjoy consent? Okay, I'm sorry. I can read. I can read. Okay, everyone give me like a moment of silence so I can read it. Embarrassing. You're embarrassing me. You're embarrassing me. Okay. Do I like women? Do I like the girls? Do the girls like me? We already know the answer to that. We already know the answer to that. Stop playing with me. Um, yes, all the time, quite a bit. Yeah, um, what? Now and then, hardly ever, never. All the time. Call me. <laughs> what city would you most like to live in? New York, London, Paris, San Francisco, Tokyo, Moscow. Um, I don't know where Moscow is. Don't, don't eat me up. Don't eat me up. I just, I'm just being honest. It said to be honest, Scouts Honor, I'm being for real. You know what's weird? I have like this weird obsession with New York, but I also had this weird obsession with Paris for a long time. Fun fact, I took French for like two years. The only thing I know how to say is bonjour, je m'appelle Agnès. That's about it. And, uh, ooh, je... These new ones, which means I'm 19. Oh, I'm not even 19 anymore, I'm 20. Oh my God. I took uh, French for two years and learned nothing. I think ordinary terror is a computer. But then again, I also think that's Spanish, so not too much, not too much. We're just gonna say New York. New York, get the fuck out of New York. We don't want you no more. Yeah, I feel like I give the girls Brooklyn, you feel me? What's your drink of choice? Beer, beer tastes like urine. I don't know. And don't be like, oh, how you know what urine smell like? It smell like, I'm <laughs> how you know what urine tastes like? It tastes like how it smells, I would assume. Gross. Um, gin and tonic, white wine, cocktails, stout. I don't even know what that is. Whiskey, ooh, brown liquor. I've always wanted to be like a wine girly, you know? Like, you know like the pretty girls always have like their robe and like their hair wrapped up in the towel and they have like a glass of wine. I've always wanted to be a wine girly. Wine gives me headaches, so. But I still feel like for like my like personal aesthetic, I don't even drink for real, but if I did, I feel like I'd be like a wine girly. Minus the headaches. 
So we're going to be like, we're going to say wine. We're going to say wine. Okay, just to clarify, do you like having relations with people of the same sex as you? Scandalous! Now, or sort of, now and then. Mm, I already told you, yes, I do quite a lot. Quite a lot. Mm, I don't want to see quite a lot. It's going to make me sound like a whore. But, you know, you know. I already told you yes, babe. Very much into the girlies. What's your ideal Saturday night? In the bed. In the bed. Not like that. I mean like sleep. Oh my God, Anya. I meant sleep in the bed. I meant like, oh my God. Pause. My bad. Hubbing till 5 a.m. Movie. Dinner and a movie. Quiet drinks with fr Quiet drinks. Girl, everyone knows if you drink it, ain't nobody quiet. Nobody's quiet, especially not me. Doing something new, house party, night in with Netflix. Now this is gonna make me also sound like a whore, but I'm just, I'm very much a homebody and an introvert, so. I like watching movies, am I basic? Oh my God, oh my God. A little, I am a little. Ooh, hang on, have you ever felt sexually attracted to someone of the same? Oh my God. Yes, I have, obviously your questions are weird quite often actually, okay. Next, come on now, I'm trying to get. Which US president do you most identify with? These are such terrible choices. Ronald Reagan, isn't he the devil? Uh-uh, why my age so long? Ooh, girl. Damn Howard Taft. I don't even know who, I don't even know who he is. Abe Lincoln. Although Abe freed the slaves, I don't think he messed with us for real. Not even gonna hold you. I'm just going with Barack, you know, my brother in arms, period. Even though he did some, he did some funky stuff too, but we're not even gonna discuss. What's your favorite root vegetable? I like potatoes. I like fries. I like mashed potatoes. I like a baked potato. I like potato skins. You know what I'm saying? I love, I do love, I do love the potato. The t the potatoes, Anya, please. If you could pick your ideal partner for a romantic date, what qualities would they have? They'd have to be the same sex as me. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Is that all we care about right now? Is that is that all, is that it? What about what about like intelligence? Humor? Intelligence? I I'd hate to be with a dummy. Preferably the same sex, but mostly, you know, hot. Don't care about their, you know, sex. Care about wine. Wow, that's a very alcoholic answer. Ideally the opposite sex, but it's no biggie. They must be the, uh, you No, know, it's crazy. I do think dates are boring, but like, you know, mm, dates are boring. Dates are boring. Pick a weather phenomenon. I love the rain. So like, where is that at? Big, beautiful rainbow, ball of lightning, tornado, sunshine, little fluffy clouds, flooding. Flooding is crazy. Gotta be honest with you sunshine where's rain i guess we'll go with the sunshine i mean i guess oh cheeks oh i can't put this on youtube so like we'll be right back okay pick an arbitrary box box a b box three box four this box screw your boxes this box period a plane leaves new york at 4 15 p.m local time bond for London, oh, bound. Oh my God, Anya, English was not that hard. Traveling at 500 miles per hour, another plane leaves London at 9.30 p.m. local time, heading in the opposite direction. Traveling at 550 miles per hour, if they maintain a constant airspeed, do you ever want to have relations with someone of the same relations? What? What? Yes? Question mark? Very good. Oh, well, you know, that feels accurate. But then there's Duke Dennis, so I don't understand my plight. Like, what's going on? Huh. We'll just ignore that. We'll just come back to that, like, if I ever, you know, have a chance. Mm. 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 We'll leave that alone for now. You are very gay. You really enjoy having relations with members of the same gender. You are attracted both physically and emotionally to the people of blah, 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 blah. I could have told you that. I could have told you that this quiz did nothing for me. All right, next quiz. This one is a little spicier. Are you a top or a bottom? Now, there's been speculation, obviously through the slew of web stories that have been written about me about whether or not I do whatever to whatever and whenever. This quiz will answer hopefully everyone's questions, even my own. 
Ooh, actually, I'm a little curious. I am a little curious. Actually, this is gonna be interesting. You're dying to know, don't try to deny it. Lucky for you, here are 12 questions that can tell you once and for all, are you a top or a bottom? So, yeah, let's do it. Answer honestly, don't be shy, share your results. Okay. Let's go. All right, honesty scouts honor. Okay, pick a color. Red, yellow, orange, blue, purple, green. We did purple last time. We're going to go with blue. Feeling festive. Feeling festive. Okay, namaste. Pick a yoga pose. Wow. This feels very intimate. Can you take me out to dinner first? What's going on? Mm -hmm. I don't know what he's doing, but okay. Do you prefer to be in charge in the... Jesus, we'll just add... Okay, so what, since we be in direct... Since we be in direct... Is there any other way? It depends. None of your business. No, I don't really care. Yes, it depends. Don't ask. Jesus, I already clicked it. Don't ask too many questions. At all. I don't want to hear nothing. I swear to God. I don't want to hear nothing. Oh, my God. No. No. Cool. Want to split this piece of cake? Pick a slice. What does this have to do with anything? Ooh, this piece. I'm not hungry. You pick first. Okay, really? This piece looks good. What piece of cake? Where is the cake? Where's the cake? Like, am I picking from this specific or like, is there like another cake? Cause I don't even see any slices. Are we in this is like one slice cutting the slices. Um, this piece looks good. I don't know what that piece has to. Oh my God, that piece was on the bottom. Oh, they got me. I mean, who's your favorite golden girl? Dorothy, period. If y'all have never seen that TV show, Maude, catch up. Mustard, please. On Saturday night, you are most likely staying in movie night with friends at a local dive bar. Can't remember clubbing, Netflix all night. Movie night with friends. I really do like movies, y'all. Like, I swear, oh my God, I love me a good, a good film. A good, ooh, something like a movie that gives you like goosebumps and like when the movie ends, you're like, dang, I wish the movie wouldn't end. Like, I'm such like a movie nerd. Hypothetically, when playing America's pastime, would you rather pitch or receive? Would I rather throw the ball or catch it? throw it I'd rather throw it right play catcher play the field I hate baseball I okay I actually do hate baseball respectfully I'm not a sports girly like at all I don't get sports I don't like that I'm not into it that's just not for me where would you love to live Wyoming New York Oregon Alaska West Virginia Illinois you know what's crazy I really this is going to sound really weird but I low-key want and maybe because I'm a Virgo who knows but I kind of want to own like a cottage in like Virginia or like the like Vermont or something. I just want to stay somewhere really pretty like this. So that's what we're gonna pick. What are your thoughts of wearing a ah! Ah! It was pretty much asking me how I feel about wearing sticks. Please put two and three together. Follow me, please. YouTube, please don't demonetize me. I swear to God, I didn't pick this. I didn't pick this. I'm not answering this question in front of y'all. I'm literally, I'm literally not. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Just to be clear, during sexy time, what is sexiest to you? Being on top, who's asking, being dominated, just having relations would be sexy, being the aggressor, not being on top. I don't know. That's really why I've taken the quiz. When I tell y'all I really don't know, I really don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Oh my God, I don't know. If I knew, I wouldn't be taking this quiz. Duh. At brunch, you can be found sipping on all the mimosas, coffee, water, at least three things, protein shake. I'm still in bed, to be honest. I'm still in the bed, respectfully. Respectfully. I don't know when brunch is, but girl, I sleep until like 12. So like, <laughs> I miss brunch and breakfast <laughs> and, and a good piece of lunch. Oh! Girl with a picture of two bunnies getting down with the get down. I'm not even, I cannot make this up. And how would you define yourself? I consider myself versatile. I don't use those terms. I don't really care. That's what this quiz is for. Isn't, thank you. Oh, they got me. Ooh. Versatile, you must be super a comic. Why are you giving me a picture of a bunk bed? You trying to be funny? Cause we can be hysterical. You must be super accommodating and always go with the flow or maybe not your day-to-day -day personality traits don't define what you do in the bedroom. And frankly, it's no one's business but your own. I think, I think that sounds, you know, close enough. Close enough. I feel good. I feel good about that. All right, last quiz, last quiz. Um, Which gay tribe do I belong to? Are you a twink or a muscle daddy? 
I am a lady, so this is gonna be interesting. Um, what is what would you describe your build? Stocky, skinny, slim, muscle tone, average. Stocky. Am I ock, y'all? Oh, am I ock, y'all? Uh. You don't put stocky. I feel real ock. I feel real ock. You know what I'm saying? What's your? Uh, I don't care. I don't care. Oh my god. What is your body hair situation? A little hairy, hairy but neat, trimmed, barely hair. I don't know, hairy but neat? I like to think like, you know, I'm very put together. You know, I like to think that. I feel very put together, you know? I do, I do. What tribe are you most attracted to? What is this? Why I didn't notice this was a quiz for gay men, I will never understand. Oh my God, I'm so stupid. Somebody revoke my gay card because I think I understand three of these terms. I know twink, I know bear. Girl, I don't know. What's geek? I don't wanna tap it and I don't know what it is, but I also don't wanna Google it. No one in the comments say anything to me right now. I sense it, do not say anything to me. Do not say anything to me. Thank you. What's your favorite position? We'll be right back. We'll be right back. Scruff, Hornet, Jacked, Gator. Something tells me this is for men. Grinder. If I was a gay man, it would be Grinder. Twink. Oh! Small and build. I said I was Ock. Man. And has a stereotype of being blind. Well, that's not true. Oof. Because of their friends, not true at all. The shelf life of a twink is early 20s. Well, I am, tw you know, close enough. If I was a gay man, this would have fit me perfectly. Yeah, so that just about wraps up today's video. I'm gonna have to blur a lot of stuff out, cut a whole lot of stuff out, because God, these these quizzes were a bit gross. Period dot, like actually kind of disgusting. But it's okay, it's okay. Um, yeah, I hope you guys learned a little bit about me, but not too much and don't play with me. Don't play with my intelligence. Don't even do that. Thank you. Happy early pride month, period. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, that's my rest of today's video. Um, don't forget to create your own happiness and let me know what other quizzes or stuff that we should take. That'll be fun. This should be a new thing. This should be, but like something, maybe something a little less explicit. How about that? Um, but yeah, don't forget to create your own happiness and I'll see you the next time I decide to expose myself with BuzzFeed quizzes. Bye, I love you. Mwah.